Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be about the various things that I've been shopping lately. Now I have been shopping a lot lately thanks to all the sales that are going on online and this online shopping is like it's a crazy bug that if one bites you you're gonna be addicted your whole life so yeah I got some of the stuff delivered to me and I couldn't wait to share it with you guys and there is a lot more stuff that is coming in my mail um, so yeah probably you'll see a few more videos very soon if in case you want me to share those with you so right now without any further ado let's get started in no particular order I'm just gonna grab uh, whatever comes into my hand and uh, I'll show it to you so the very first thing is this uh, we will cell renew clarifying skin toner which is alcohol free and it has calendula extracts it says it is ph balanced it is dermatologically tested and it's suitable for all skin types. now if you don't know um uh, vivel actually came out with a makeup remover which also has exactly same packaging so i actually wanted to buy that somehow i ended up adding this into my cart and not the uh, makeup remover and when the stuff got delivered to me i was like uh this is not what i wanted i tried to return it to flipkart flipkart is where i bought it from so i tried to return it to them but they were not ready to do that so i kept it with me the next product is this a uh, blossom culture my magic olive oil now I was looking uh, for a nice olive oil for uh, you know massaging into my hair now I have um, I have really really dry hair so uh, once I wash my hair I tried to add some sort of oil onto my scalp you know just a drop or two and I wanted something which is not very heavy uh, and can be used on my scalp post washing the hair so I bought this uh, olive oil from Aroma Magic I really really like the packaging it looks very attractive to me so this is the second thing that I got I have been investing uh, my money uh, on hair styling products a lot lately one of the things that I got is this uh, hair brush from Kent this is your ionic your uh, you know this one has nylon bristles in it and it helps in blow drying your hair really nicely it gives a nice shine uh, makes the hair really sleek silky smooth uh, so that is one of the things that I got for hairstyling and this one I got from Nika it was on sale and I got it for a great great okay. so next we have here some Paul's eyelashes these one are from PAC I think that's how you call them I think that's how you pronounce it PAC or PAC it's basically professional artist cosmetics uh, if you are someone who loves makeup you would know that we do not get a lot of options when it comes to good quality affordable eyelashes in India yes we do have Ardell available but then again the the kind of lashes uh, that you want and then you have to if in case they are available online then you have to pay like ridiculous amount of money to buy them so I accidentally stumbled upon PAX website I knew of PAX brushes beforehand but I did not know that they made uh, a lot of other stuff as well so I uh, actually bought these off Amazon but you can definitely buy it from PAX official website as well I think I paid 125-150 rupees each for every eyelash set but on uh, PAX uh, official website these retail for 100 bucks and I got three variants of these lashes and I'm so so impressed let me know if you guys want to see a detailed review of these I can talk about the quality I can tell you how to put them on and all that stuff so let me know and I'll do it for you guys we have a skincare item which is this sunscreen by sun coat yeah this is basically sun coat gel now I have very very sensitive skin like I just said and uh, for me to find a product that actually works for me and does not break me out is is, is a big task so I was actually looking for um, some sunscreen gels for oily acne prone skin I, I was googling and then I came upon this article uh, which was written by if I'm not mistaken it's by it was by a row uh, blossom coacher I guess and she either blossom coacher or someone else some really renowned uh, skincare specialist of course and she had mentioned sun coat gel for oily and acne prone skin types uh, the great thing about this sunscreen is that um, it's available at 
all the cosmetic not really cosmetic stores and all the chemist shops you can go and buy this and it's very very affordable i've been using it and if you i it kind of really like it it hasn't broken me out and the best part it is very very lightweight it is gel basically you put it on it feels a little sticky initially but after around a minute uh, your face feels so smooth and it's so lightweight you don't even feel like you're wearing anything and it is spf 30 and it is very very effective in protecting you from sun's harmful rays so that's the next thing that i got okay so next skincare item is this uh face cleansing brush by uh oriflame uh i got this thanks to debashri i had watched her video and i was actually looking for a good quality facial cleansing brush which doesn't cost a bomb uh, and I had my eyes set on the Ole one and then I had also seen uh, another one from another brand uh, which I can't really recall so those were the kind of brushes that I was looking for uh, in that sort of price range and when they actually talked about this I thought you know what let me just, let me just go and take a look and I went ahead and I bought it and I'm pretty happy with it I've been uh, using it since January I ordered it on my birthday I presented it as a gift to me so um, I've been using it since January and it's March now so I think I know how this fares and if in, guy, if in case you guys want to see a detailed review of this how do I use it uh, if it makes any difference to your skin at all especially if you're really really oily and most of most of all if you have sensitive acne prone skin if, if it works for you guys or not then leave me a comment below and I shall do a detailed review of this video. The hair styling item that I got was this uh, Babyliss, Babyliss or Babyliss however you might pronounce it Sublim Touch uh, Hair Curler. I got this off Nika on this recent sale I think it was the Valentine's sale that was going on and I got it for a great price and this is the actual one this is how it looks like I've been using it for a while uh, haven't really gotten used to it much but I'll be using it for a month and then if in case you guys want me to tell you how to style your hair in different ways using something like this then let me know but yeah you know these kind of tongs really come in handy and they're very quick when you want to create different sort of hairstyles especially curls I love curls I don't really uh, like hair, straight hair as much as I love curls so this is the other thing that I got next we have some more pack stuff now our pack uh, team was kind enough to send me some of this stuff for review purposes they sent me the long lasting cold pencil is this beauty and if you can see I've been using it for a while and first impressions I'm blown away it's amazing amazing the other thing they've sent is the pack intense auto coat then the most exciting product is this makeup sponge by pack uh, this is set to be the dupe of the beauty blender of course everything is so similar I haven't used it yet but I really like the packaging and I'm gonna use it for a while before I make up my mind and I share my reviews with you all oh, next thing they sent was this makeup sponge again this is by my pack this is your uh, regular makeup sponges I guess uh, they say this is for blending your foundation the powder uh everything so that's so next i got the uh, real techniques makeup sponges this is a pack of two there was a great deal going on and i bought this for myself as a gift uh, on my birthday uh, and i think there is again a great deal going on right now i don't know if it's on flipkart or amazon but i would leave a daddy link next i got uh, some of the uh, sivana blushers for review purposes i've been using them for a while and i really really like them uh, I don't know, I think the review video would have gone up by the time I would share these with you here. So if in case it would have, I would share the link in the description box. You can go check it out because the next hair styling item that I got is this Roots Professional Hair Dryer. This is something again that I got from um, Nika and I really really love how powerful uh, this hair dryer is. It really uh, blow dries your hair quickly uh, it reduces the frizz to a great extent also it imparts a really nice shine to my hair and mind you mine hair is really difficult to work with they're like they have a mind of their own they're very frizzy they're kind of dry um, so this has been working really well for me if you guys want to see how much difference it makes to your hair and how it helps in blow drying your hair let me know in the comment section below as usual 
and I shall next I got these colored eyeliners by Gala of London and I'm extremely excited about these because um, I you know Gala of London has been there in the market for so long but I have never been intrigued enough to buy a product from them so recently I was looking for some budget friendly um, eyeliners that I can use every day and then I stumbled upon these Gala of London eyeliners uh, which this one actually came with a pack of three we have a blue eyeliner then we have a brown eyeliner and then we also have the standard regular black eyeliner and it is really good uh, I am really liking it and these are the only eyeliners that I've been using um, you know since the day I've got them and the best part is that it's really easy to create a wink with these so yeah these are really good Again, if you want me to do a review on these, please let me do it for you guys. I'll include everything, you know, all the swatches and everything, all the details, right? Okay, so next I got this eye shadow from Makeup Revolution. This one is in the shade Purple Heaven. This is from their Mono Eyeshadow range. Um, this is such a beautiful purple, iridescent purple sort of a color. It has, uh, it actually reflects a lot of blue in it. It has some sort of silver undertones. Let me just watch it. This is how it looks. It's a very, very dreamy color. And I was really intrigued to try this on. Uh, it swatches beautifully, but we'll see if it transfers equally beautifully on the eyes or not. And we have uh, this uh, Makeup Revolution palette, which is the Redemption Palette Essential Shimmers. This is the palette. Uh, I have heard a lot about it, so I bought it. I've been using it for quite a while. Um, so it comes in this packaging, we have all these beautiful shades in there. It leans more towards purples, I would say. It has a lot of purple variants in the palette. So that's one of the things that I got this uh, Makeup Revolutions Run Boy Run palette. This is the original palette. Unfortunately, I dropped it and I broke the, uh, the cap. It has come off. And then I also lost one of the eyeshadows here. So this is basically the palette and I quite like it. Let me know if you guys want to see a detailed review. And another very affordable drugstore product that I am really excited about is this Color Essence HD uh, Setting Powder. Uh, the one thing that really attracted me to this was that this has such strong yellow undertones and to get a strongly yellow setting powder in India is not easy. I mean, we have a lot of compacts but we don't have a lot of loose powders which are so affordable. So this is something I'm very, very excited. We have uh, the Real Techniques Co Collection set. I wanted to get myself some basic uh, good quality brushes. So of course, you know, Real Techniques is the thing to go for. If you're looking for uh, good quality, makeup brushes which are equally affordable I can go for something like this uh, apart from real techniques I am also intrigued by the brushes from pack then I've also seen a lot of Kent brushes online and the root brushes so these are like really affordable brushes in the Indian market at this point of time and I got myself uh, the you know standard classic core collection set and uh, let me go if, let me know if you guys have used uh, the brushes from Kent or Roots and how do they fare if not let me know if you guys want to see a review on those because I've been eyeing some of the brushes from those brands as well and I'm gonna get my hands on those very well. next I've been using this Nivea whitening smooth skin deodorant now this is my HD stuff I buy it all the time every time one bottle lasts you so long and the best thing about these is that um, these really help in keeping you fresh uh, they they don't have a fragrance that would reach out to someone who is one feet away from you but this is something which keeps you fresh it doesn't let the body odor uh, come out and yeah it's something which stays all day long it's, it's really nice and it is alcohol free so I absolutely love it and it also comes in a lot of variants I think there is one which has citrusy smell as well so I'm gonna go and buy that as well since the summers are coming actually summers have already come and now I'm missing winters and they were when they were winters I wanted it to be all summer. I want, I want to talk about the KLM Clean Face Washes. This is my HG stuff. I've been using these face washes for the past three years, I would like to say. Um, and this is something which was prescribed to me by my dermatologist. If you have oily skin, if you have acne prone skin, if you have sensitive skin, 
this is the face wash you want to get your hands on this is hands down the best face wash for acne prone oily sensitive skin ever then the last few things that i have here are um, i got this maybelline brow duo in the shade brown if you know me you would know that i've been using the uh, i had been actually using the uh, makeup revolutions brow duo for so long uh, and it had actually come into market before maybelline launched its brow duo so i've been using it and trust me i hate to say this but i like the makeup revolutions brow duo more than the maybelline's probably because the dark brown color that they have is like more natural this brown color sort of seems a little bit unnatural to me so not bad but i think i'll do something better so i'm going to go and stick to make a production brown duo that's about it for today's video guys i hope you enjoyed this different video i don't usually do the haul videos but i thought it would be a nice change from the regular makeup stuff um so yeah that's pretty much about it and like i said if any of the products that i mentioned in the video today if you want me to do a review on any of those just leave a comment below and i shall do it for you guys and yeah if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet then please do so hit the subscribe button and also share this video if in case you want to help me out to reach out to a lot more people and yeah i think that's all i have to say today um i'll meet you next time until then you guys take care bye